Oh, I'm an idiot. I could have broken that boulder. I was being dumb. So don't be dumb, kids. Don't ever be dumb. Be cool, but not dumb. Because you can be cool and still be dumb. Just don't be dumb. So let's come back over here and stop this. Why is so sad? I don't know why he's so sad. Um. Uh, I think I don't need to be Mumbo anymore. So let me go to the warp pad. And head over back to Mumbo's place so I can be Banjo and Kazooie again. Because... Banjo and Kazooie are the bee's knees. They're the bee's knees, they're the cool guys, they're the... The coolest main characters of any video game ever. There is no other video game where the main characters are as cool as them. That is not my opinion. That is fact. <laughs> Alright. Uh, speed Banjo and Kazooie again. And we're gonna go and do more things. So now, what we're gonna have to do is head over to... Let's do the world entry first. And see, check out the uh, flight pad that I just destroyed this thing for. Oh wait, you know, you know what? No, I will need to go over here actually. So that way I can get the uh, nice ability. Shut up. All right, what you got for me, gem jars? Grip grab. All right, I already know what it is. Cool. <laughs> Funny. Cry for help, buddy? I got you. Get over here. Jinjo! Alright. So now we can go over here. And then now we can do the thing with the flight pad, I think. Oh no, I don't even need a flight pad, do I? Let's just grab this. And go up this way. Awesome. I mean, technically now I can leave this world and go to the next world, but I'm not going to because I'd rather get all of the, uh, all of the, um, uh, shoot. All, the, just all the stuff, all the collectibles in this world. Like the jiggies and then the, uh, and whatever else. What's this? Oh, awesome! So now it's the cool part of the game, where it's, uh... Because, as you all know, this was made by Rare, or Rare Rare at the time, Rare Rare, whatever. And they made the GoldenEye video game, 007. And what that... And so, the same developers put in this game a really cool treat. Uh, where it becomes an FPS. <laughs> of course, because it was the gun. So, and very much in the vein of uh, GoldenEye. So, it has a similar controls because it's an N64 game. Um, um, but I don't feel like... Here, I, w I won't do this yet. I'll wait until later when I'm more... Uh, cause I feel very sloppy right now with the controls. I, I don't feel comfortable yet. I still have to get used to them again. Um, could just come over here and do this. Cause I just remembered this is a thing. So what we gotta do is grab that, shoot that. 
does it have to be exact? No, it does not. Uh, this is kind of awesome. And the final one. If I'm <laughs> okay, I thought I was gonna miss it, and <laughs> that'd be hilarious. And can I? No, now I have to fly. But first, let me go in here and see what the dude wants. Yeah, someone probably stole it. It's a really cool game because you get like a little hint of what's to come in the future worlds. It's, it's really nice. Because then you get excited, you're like, oh man, I can't wait to get there. And then when you do, it's like the best feeling ever. So now I have to fly there. So let me go back to the uh, world entry. But guess what? I don't have to walk all the way there. All I got to do is take the warpad. That simple. So now I just gotta get this thing. Whoosh. The thing that is like the actual sound effect that the game makes. It's just like, whoosh. Which is another thing I love about this, since the awesome sound designer and uh, music composer for the game is Grant Kirkhope. He does that. He, like, uses his voice for, or someone's voice for, um, a lot of the sound effects. And it's really cool. It's really neat. I like it. Um. You have to be patient. There we go. And I missed that Cheeto. No! Wait, hold on. Very quick. Wait. Let me let me just very quickly. Just very quickly let me uh, grab that Cheeto. Awesome. Alright, now we're going to come back in here. Treasure chamber. No, let's have to go this way. Awesome. Yeah, here's a little sneak peek of what's to come. A little sneak peek at the the world that that's personally my favorite world in the entire game. Here's Unga Bunga's cave. Now what we gotta do is tiptoe. Just slightly tilt the the left stick up. Slightly tilted. Just slightly. Ever so slightly, just slightly. No! It's too slight. And then now you're over here on the on this thing. And then now you just gotta um, grab the grab the treasure and uh, walk yourself back. And once you do that, you're gonna, you're gonna save the world. I walk in this golden treasure back to uh, where you came from. Man, I can't wait to like show off the uh, this world. It's gonna be awesome. Shoot, which way is it? Oh, oh, this way, right? No, wait. No, this way. Okay, cool. All the gold, all the gold in that room, make it a um. Now you might freak out at first and be like, "Oh no, what? It was in my hands. What happened?" It still is. Don't worry. Wait, no, no, no. Oh, whatever. Awesome. <laughs> Careful, this is a family game. Awesome. Yep, you in trouble now, Ungabunga. <laughs> Big beatings. <laughs> so this guy in Klungo, they've got a club going on where they get beat. They get beaten by uh, someone. I 
And then where was it? No. Let's see. There it is. Okay. Awesome. So we got five so far. Good. And then there was something else. There was another, uh, I have to take the flight thing again, because there was another thing. Let's see. And then there's also the other stuff in the other, uh, little rooms, or little... I mean, technically the rooms, like in the game's map, but I mean... The other sections of this world. So, but first, I need to do this, because there's another thing you do with the, uh, flight. Yeah, see? Whoosh! Or whoosh! It's a voice. Alright. Awesome. Got myself a Jinjo. It's a brown Jinjo. Cafecito. A Jinjo. See this dude. Stop right there. Oh man, the coolest one of the coolest parts of the game. This game just has a bunch of nice, like little little neat uh things that are different. Like there's always a unique thing in each world, and it overall just becomes a unique mechanic. It's just really, it's just really cool. It's a really cool game. Um, wow. <laughs> it's only for stones, you guys. No one else can get get in, okay? No one else is allowed in. No other kinds of people. Only stonies. Um. So now. We come. Through this gate. To grab more things. Um. I already got that. Uh, come down here. So our first introduction to Humba Wumba is in the Mayan temple, the Mayan world, whatever it's called, I forgot. But, um, hey, whatever. Yeah, give you a globo. Check out my globo! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> And now we go in here. And this is another cool part of the game. Because it's also in the first game. Where you transform. But this is the worst transformation. I just find it annoying and, and, and just... I just don't like it. It just makes me feel... I don't know. I don't like it. But... So this, in my opinion, is like the worst of the transformations. I just... Ugh. I just don't like it. Alright. So now we're going to come down here. Shut up. Oh, wait, hold on. This dude. Alright, cool. I think I might have already known that. So now I'm going to go to the world entry because then there's another uh, gate to go through. Okay, no. My boss. Now let's go through the gate. And I have to remember what the, uh... Hmm. Oh, wait, no, there was also the thing in the entry. In the, in, in the world entry. Just remembered. Whatever, I'll go back later. So... We come through here, and then we will find ourselves this stony. All 
All right, so moon, star, sun, moon, star, sun, moon, star, sun, moon, star, sun, moon, star, sun. Let's get that. Oh, there's a warp head here. Moon, star, sun. So moon, star, sun. Star? No. Dang it, what did the dude say? Oh, crap. Gotta start over. Um. Okay. Moon. Star. Oh, two more stars. Okay, two more stars. Awesome. <laughs> little rabid friend. Yeah, then I would probably stay away. Oh, but I need the drill thing. Yeah, I can't punch it. Oh, man. Oh, well. Let's go over... Where is it? Over here? Let me, let me see. Oh no, because from here I need to get the uh, thing that's... Okay, okay, no, 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 not yet. Uh, let's go back here and then go to the world entry and then finally go into that kickball competition thing. Where that jerk was being... Uh, I don't know if that would be racist because... Are the stones a race? Whatever, the guy was mean. He said that we couldn't join because we weren't stone. Or maybe we just have to. Oh no, we just gotta. We just gotta um, take some hits. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Be stoned. Banjo the Stony. <laughs> but they're a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he, already, he already salted our disguise. That's the best. That's like, oh man, I love the humor in this game. All right, let's get on going. Let's get on going. So now we're going to grab this warp pad, which will allow us to teleport here whenever we want. Yay. Hold on, oh, what's up here? Let's do. What you say? Fine, I'll take some training downstairs so I can remember how to do it. But this thing, though. Oh, no, it's uh, no, on the other side. Dang it. Oh, well. All right, let's go to the training and remember how to do this. So. That's right, Z is to kick. All right, Z is to kick. Okay, cool. And then that's to like kind of like um, slide and grab the ball and, and take it from them, the other team. Okay, I don't need no mores. Wait, wait, I think if you hold it, right, it's like more intense or whatever. Let me see. I, I think I think so. Let me see. Turn around and boom. Yeah, okay, it's a, it's a more it's a pow more powerful uh, kick when you hold down Z or er, right trigger <laughs> or left trigger. All right, we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this right, mind kickball. We're gonna do this. Do it. <laughs> hey, whack. <laughs> His name is Whack. All right. Best Stony. Mon. You can't handle this. Homie. Homie, no. No. Mine. 
You can't handle this. Oh man, I was about to kick that. Whatever. That was intense. Awesome. Semi-finals it is. Let's do this. These guys are picking on me. <laughs> My shorts don't look stupid. At least I'm wearing bottoms. No, did I? Whatever, I won. Alright. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this final right here. And we're gonna win it. We're gonna win it for the team. We're gonna win it for every team. Every team that be teaming in this game. I'm going to win this for everyone. Everyone that has ever been a friend. <gasps> Did you just steal that from me, you jerk? Shoot, 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 shoot. Nope. No! Ha! Hey, morons. Oh my goodness, no! No, dude! Oh, man. It's not my... F uh. Yes, I want to play again. I was really messing up on that. I was sucking so bad. No, 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 mine. Mine. Dang it. Mine, 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 mine. Mine. Ha <laughs> ha. I win. Yeah. You don't win. I win. Yeah, buddy. Six jiggies. I am a champion. Out of the wigwam.